In this era of downsized engines, one thing under the hood that's not getting smaller is the alternator. Today's late model vehicles come with bells and whistles such as touchscreen infotainment displays, USB charging ports, high-powered audio systems, and a growing assortment of ADOS features. Due to the increasing power demands, we're seeing 120, 160, and even 200 amp alternators in vehicles to power their electrical and electronic systems. The alternator is part of the accessory dry belt system, and it's usually driven by the serpentine belt. Keep in mind that the belt is not simply spinning, but it's actively transferring power from the crankshaft throughout all the accessories. Vibrations occur in the belt as the vehicle accelerates and decelerates. The mass of the alternator creates resistance against the serpentine belt when the engine accelerates and then decelerates. Also, the belt experiences micro vibrations with every power pulse of the engine and when accessories such as the AC compressor cycle on and off. If these vibrations are not properly managed, they can cause several problems in the system, namely belt flutter, belt slip, and unwanted noise. Belt flutter hammers the accessories the belt comes in contact with. Belt slip causes friction, excessive heat, and wear on the belt. If this is not corrected with complete serpentine belt system maintenance, the slipping gets worse. Material wears away from the ribs and causes the belt to bottom out. Excessive belt flutter and belt slip can affect the performance of the alternator and other accessories. So how do vehicle manufacturers manage this, especially when the system is using a higher amperage alternator? Well, in addition to the serpentine belt, the automatic belt tensioner, and a harmonic balancer, these systems also include a decoupler pulley attached to the alternator. In particular, we're seeing a type of decoupler pulley called the Overrunning Alternator Decoupler Pulley, or OAD, especially on four-cylinder vehicles. Like all decoupler pulleys, the OAD disengages the alternator's rotational mass from the belt drive when there's sudden belt deceleration. An OAD pulley also features a sophisticated internal spring and clutch system, a damper, that absorbs the force generated by belt accelerations and tension reversals. By eliminating damaging peaks in belt tension, it can extend the life of belts, tensioners, and other dry belt components and make for a smoother running system. It also enables the engine to operate more efficiently and helps minimize noise, vibration, and harshness. Here's the most important thing your customers should know about OAD pulleys. If their vehicle's alternator is equipped with an OAD pulley, they need to make sure the replacement unit has the same technology. If your professional or DIY customers use another type of decoupler pulley or solid pulley on an alternator that requires an OAD pulley, it won't provide the same dampening or overrunning protection, and they run the risk of damaging other components in the dry belt system. I'm Josh Cable. Thanks for watching.